In this video, I'm going to discuss the differences between a ring flash and a twin flash system. Both of these systems are perfect for dental photography, and the choice of which one you use is really dependent on what end result you're looking for. So let's start with the similarities. Well, firstly, they both illuminate the subject, so there's no changes there. Secondly, they are both quite powerful flashes, so they can expose the image when shooting with a small aperture and a low ISO. The main differences between them is a twin flash allows control over light angle and the ability to add diffusion, such as soft boxes. To do so, it requires a bracket. Well, the good news for this system is that Godox actually now produced the MF12 Quick Kit with a bracket and diffusion included. So this is great if you were looking for an all-in-one solution without having to purchase all of these things separately. And it's also going to be a much cheaper alternative that will have, definitely have a big impact on the dental market. So what do softboxes actually do and, and when would you need to have control over light angle? Well, light angle affects shadow, so the closer the light is to the lens barrel, the less shadow will be created, and the more even the illumination. So a ring flash like this one, for example, is ideal for dental photography within the oral cavity, due to its close proximity to the lens barrel. Sometimes, however, you may want to manoeuvre the light to one side, so you may want to create depth or to light into an area of interest, in order to create a black background, for example and having a twin flash system bracket would allow you to do so. This Godox twin flash bracket also comes with these diffusion attachments, which are similar to that of a result of a softboxes. You might have seen the softboxes out there. Well, diffusion softens the light to reduce specular highlights, which smooths them out to make a more aesthetically appealing image. And while it might be more visually appealing, specular highlights are actually a key to demonstrating texture. So it's really a decision as to what you're aiming to achieve. I think the biggest difference between them and the choice over which you get is ultimately decided upon the complexity versus simplicity, with the twin flash system being more ad adaptable and an improved aesthetic result, but with some added complexity, and the ring flash, which is much similar to use, but does not allow that maneuverability. In my opinion, and the kit that I would use most is the ring flash kit. So if I had to choose between these two, I would pick this, this ring flash kit. Um, not only does it have, um, it now has decent diffusion that, that almost mimics a softbox, but it allows me to remove this off to do pictures um, from the side so I can create a black background just from taking this off. So you do get some maneuverability of the light, but also it's the added ease in use that this becomes a bit more complex. This is a bit easier to pick up straight out the box and use straight away without having the complexities of moving this. It also creates standardization um, whereby sometimes when you're using a bracket such as this, you may maneuver the flash and moving the flash from the pre-op picture to a post-op picture can change the resulting image. And what we want is standardization to be able to get that same picture over a period of time. So if you are taking pictures over a period of time and you're measuring um, the change in pathology or any sort of physical change, what you want is standardization, the ability to take a picture every time from the same angle with the same lighting setup. And this is the best way of doing it um, with this flash. I think the only time that I would recommend using this system, if you want to do more creative photography, you want to do um, tabletop shots, models, um, anything else that requires a bit more creativity, um, I would definitely recommend getting a kit like this. Or if you want to, just get both and have two separate camera kits, one with a ring flash and one with one for more creative artistry work and one for your standard dental practice where you're taking before and after pictures for every patient.